Okay, I'm gonna test the glow plugs here. I'm just doing a resistance check on them to make sure they read some resistance. So one ohm, that's good. Got one ohm, body of it and the terminal. Now making a good connection. We'll set that one aside as a maybe. Basically if it read OL or some really high resistance number, there's one. That would tell me it's bad. Like the other one was acting funny, so I don't think I'll use it. You see, I'm just going there and where the connector hooks up. These are basically just creating a direct short when you put these in there. What happens is this little rod down here, you apply 12 volts to it, and there's a little wire element inside of here, and that gets really hot. Essentially what that does is it makes the engine easier to start in cold weather is the goal. You know, see, they're all reading pretty close the same. Mine was a little lower, so we're setting them aside. That could be my connections too. That's pretty close. Let's see what this one is. Yeah, that's pretty close to saying. There's one of them. Yeah, so it just wasn't a good connection when I was doing that. That's pretty close. So in there, that was a lower resistance. Try it. No, that one's broke. Yeah, the tip bust off it. Yeah, that one's open. So that's not good. That one's reading. Well, oh, there we go. There was our one. Got one more here. Nuts pretty screwed up on that one. It's a point. Okay, that one be good. Okay, we're gonna put our uh, glow plugs in. First thing I'm gonna do, put some NICs on here like so. And they go in right here. NICs just helps later on when you go to remove them. The book doesn't say anything about it. They tur torque to 13 foot pound, which comes out to 156 foot pounds. One nice thing about having glow plugs is this one place if you've got low compression, something like that, and this is a real easy place to test. You can put a pressure gauge or something on there to check it out rather than pulling an injector and trying to find an adapter. Okay, you can break these pretty easy, so be careful with them. Okay, same thing on this side. I'm gonna anti-seize the glow plugs, which I've already done. Get them all started by hand. As long as everything's clean, they should go in good. What can happen with these is the end of the glow plug. I'll show you in just a second. The end where the heating element is, if they get left on, what they'll actually do is they'll swell up. And then when you go to pull the, when you go to pull the glow plug, it won't come out because they've swollen up. So you end up taking the cylinder head off when that happens. There again, these torque to 13 foot pounds, which is 100, 156 inch pounds. Don't mix those up. You try and put 150 pounds of these, you'll uh, definitely break them. And then you'll have a mess. Okay, before I put these on, I'm gonna take a buffer. Clean up the electrical connections. Some green crap growing on these. Very good. Clean electrical connections always work better. You get them all dirty and nasty and green like that, not gonna work. Okay, so now we're gonna go ahead and put them on there. Put the nuts on. I'm not agreeing with the service manual. Let's say to torque these to 18 foot pounds. I'm going, uh, I don't think so. Um, I took a wire brush to the glow plugs too before I did this to the top. That helps a lot as well. We're not gonna go 18 foot pounds, I'll tell you that. And you kinda wanna pull them to one side when you do this because when they torque, they may try and turn on you. Pull them away from the way you think they're gonna turn like that. And I'm going to feel this. I'm going to start out at 30 inch pounds. I would say that's plenty on these. 18 foot pounds seems ridiculous. I think it's got to be a typo. It's probably 18 inch pounds. I'm just going to... Oh no, that's way too tight. So we're just going to go essentially as tight as I can get without pulling on the ratchet. Okay, that's good enough. Snug. I'm going to guess that's a typo. It's got to be 18 inch pounds. If you put 18 foot pounds on this, you'd break them, I guarantee it. 